What are we looking at? We're looking at boat lights. There we go. I'm doing some wiring right now. This one I've got an LED and then a red light, which is not LED. But uh, that's what I got on that one so far. And then this one I don't have any. I'm just wiring it. Right now I got a positive, which comes from one of these sides up the middle then up these are two different switches so that was a little interesting to figure out and then the ground or this is the power wire in to the switch out of the switch into the bulbs <coughs> um, and then the second wire that comes out of each of these which has now confused me very much so is a ground. I don't know. It confuses me because this one's on the right and this one is on the left. Now these were partially put together so like this one I didn't do anything on this one and you can see how it's kind of lit up right there. So I don't know. I don't know. Now I've just confused myself. <laughs> so, first things first is to drill the last screw in on this. All right. Now I've already connected one <coughs> positive, and then I'm about to connect the negative at the top. All right, so up here, Connecting the negative on there. It's got to turn more about like that. You got it? Yeah. All right. Let me get this back in here. There we go. All right. Now, why don't you show them the bus bars that you have installed? Here's the bus bars. One's going to be positive, one's negative, and that's where the wires are running through. Light in the engine room. There we go, and it's LED. Perfect. So that's going to work out great. Now to install another light right there using this fuse block a box and another one right here underneath the uh, bed so that uh, when we're getting in and out of this locker here which has the tools in it that that will work out all right climbing in this is what... oh. <laughs> all right here now I'm up here Okay. All right. Sorry. Sorry. Uh, now we got the bus bars all hooked up. I don't know. The light's being weird because I have a headlamp on. And uh, uh, that's pretty sketchy right there. All right. We we'll got this going. All right, guys. Here we go. Now we've got the two lines, positive and negative, running out here, along here, going through there. And it's gonna be going up along the side right here, up, over. And I'm gonna have it ran along with these wires. See them in there? And there's the two ends that are about to connect to this. All right. So we're going to keep zip tying them along and making them look nice.
Okay, get it in there. Okay. There's my mastery of ghetto rigging. No, 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 put it over here. You're putting two right here, and then it's gonna be on the drawer right there. So split this area into three sections to keep the wire tight like a tie -out. We're using tacks right now. Uh, brass tacks, so that will work. Gold thumb tacks. They are brass. And then uh, got the little wife. Glad I left that going there. I had to extend the bed because I'm six foot, and that was not happening. And if you're wondering what this is, this is where the old gen uh, generator controls were. But when I took that out and put the tools in, see, tools, nice. See, we got some three additions over there, some bags. What's going on with that? All right, now I'm crimping the positive wire onto this one. So what I forgot, this whole time and then it's a heat shrink watertight connector so that's why I'm lighting it on fire but up right here I'm gonna add another light uh, up in here so I've got to splice it right here two or one to two so this is gonna be the desk light and this is gonna be the under the bed light right here so I got one of those done now to do the ground ground looks good stick her in there get her in there nice and good all right hold it up like that did it just spin out yep okay so what I'm doing here is I'm trying my best to work fast enough so that I have light as well tonight in here. That's the irony in working on installing your lights. <laughs> you need them to install them. Alright, there we go. Let those cool down just a little bit while I install. I'm thinking I'm going to have to go with the bigger ones. I don't think I can fit two of these wires in to that. So I'm hoping up here that I can. Oh, having these tools are amazing. I remember living life without any type of electrical tools before. And that was hard. That was a hard enough life. I'm going to try. <coughs> I'm gonna try and do this quick so as not to have a long video. Ooh, I crimped it. <laughs> There's that one. I'm pretty sure that ain't never gonna come off. That's a double neg negative right there. That's the power of double negatives. Let's see if this heat shrink will come all the way down for us. Yeah, you can use a heat gun, but the heat gun, is at the store, because I didn't buy one. <laughs> Alright, here we go. I'm going to clamp this in. Oh, and I did the same, I clamped the shoes a lot of it. Now... So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these two wires, I'm going to run them into that, install that, but at the same time I'm going to run these two into it as well. So that's going to be an interesting thing. So first thing, I'm going to screw this 
up into the bottom and then I will get back to you guys. All right, now, as you can see, I've got the one power line or well, two positive and negative lines running here to this light, which is now wired in. Now I'm going to spool this up a little bit, tidy it up and then drag it on through this way and uh, put in, install the, uh, the desk light. So, all right. All right, now I've got this little patch job here done where I'm putting on the ends to screw into the, so I've got, cause uh, they got pulled through a little bit on this end. I had them measured out perfectly, but Don was trying to make stuff look pretty. It does look pretty, so we're just gonna add a little bit on here. I know I don't like to do that because it kind of messes with the wire and just having spots where the power gets separated and push through one of these things. Not my favorite, but because it goes from the wire to the splitter or to the whatever it's called. I can't remember. To the sleeve or whatever. I don't know. Connector. Wire connector. But it will work now. So now let those cool down. Now I'm gonna go work on the other side. Why don't you show them we got the wires over there done. They're coming up and under the bed and up and over through there. They'll be cleaned up a little bit later, but there already was wire going. And now we got it wired in. Now it's just time to screw it up here. Boom, boom, that's gonna work. All right. Well, we're in darkness, so you know what that means. It means flip that switch, cause baby, we made the lights work, woo! All right, on the, on the desk we have white and we have red, which is real nice for the mood, you know? And then, um, underneath, here where the tools are, we just have like a red spectrum. So we got red spectrum here, white up there. So that's gonna work out just fine. Boom, did it. All right, y'all, that's the end of our day. Got a beautiful sunset. Now we gotta clean up and make some dinner. Mm -hmm.